Um, hi, I'm Justin, and I'm presenting our paper knowing when to look adaptive attention via visual signal for image captioning. Uh, this is a work John did, uh, done by the Timing, Davy, and Richard. Image captioning is a task that automatically generating captions for an image. Many different models have been proposed in the past, stem from the neural based method to attention based method, and most recently, RL GAN based method. In this paper, we focus on the attention-based approaches. So we would like to ask ourselves a question. What is still missing with currently attention-based image capturing system? Let's look at the same example again. Given an image, the corresponding caption is a white bird perched on the top of a red stop sign. We find that not all words in the captions have corresponding visual signals, such as word off. If we visualize the corresponding spatial attention map on different image, we find that it always focuses on the boundary or the corner part. That is some undesirable artifact caused by always attending to image. We also find the language correlation makes the visual signal unnecessary when generating some words. Given the phrase <coughs> uh, behind the red stop, we can easily predict the next words to be sign, even without looking at the image. Therefore, we need a module that can both decide when and where to tend to image when generating captions. In this paper, we propose a novel adaptive tension model with a visual sentinel. The visual sentinel is a gate function that can control how much image information is needed for the decoder. Our model both reason when and where to tend to image when generating captions. For example, our model can learn to attend image more when generating words with birth and red, and attending image less when generating words off and sign. More specifically, our spatial attention model uses the current hidden state to analyze where to look. The visual sentinel is an additional representation of the decoder's memory, provide a fallback option for the decoder. Thus, our new context vector is a mixture of spatial attentive image feature and the visual sentinel vector. Please check our poster for more information. Here are, two here are two qualitative results which shows how, atten how adaptive attention works. We see that our model learns to attend image more when generating words rows, ways, and table. Our attention, our attention, uh, our attention attend image less when generating words a, in, and so on. We validate our proposed models on Flickr 30K and Coco dataset. By adding Visual Sentinel, our adaptive attention outperforms the ability version by a large margin. Our single model also outperforms the preset of our ensemble models on all metrics. This figure shows the rank probability plot on code dataset. The vertical axis is a visual grounding probability, which defines as how much the model looks at the image when generating the words. We find that our model generally attends more on concrete objects, such as dishes, people, and table. Numbers, such as three. Our model attends less on article words, such as the, pronoun words, such as his, it, and word has strong correlations, such as phone. This is a visualization of the generated captions and image attention map on code dataset. Different color is a correspondence between the attend region and underlying words. We can see that our map correctly localizes the girl, bench, and umbrella. By knowing when to attend, we also find it leads to more accurate where to attend. Our code and pre-trained model is publicly available. Please check our poster for more information. Thank you.